Today we will be continuing the topic of types of number, but we will be looking more specifically at multiples and the LCM. So if you can write the headings, Gwaith Dosbath, multiples and LCM. So starting with multiples, what is a multiple? So multiples are the extended times table of a given number. So for example, the multiples of 20 would be 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. A thousand would also be a multiple of 20. Two thousand would also be a multiple of 20. Fifty thousand would also be a multiple of 20, as these are all in the 20 times tables. Multiples of 6, 6, 12, 18, 24, 30. So the first multiple is always the number itself. And then it's the times tables after that. So 6 times 2, 6 times 3, 6 times 4, and so on. So, some examples then. List the first five multiples of the following. So, the first five multiples of 7. Well, the first multiple of 7 is just the number itself, 7. The second multiple of 7, 7 times 2, is 14 third multiple 7 times 3 is 21 fourth multiple 7 times 4 is 28 and the fifth multiple 7 times 5 is 35 then the 12 times table so the first five multiples of 12 would be 12 2 times 12 is 24 then we got 36 48 and then finally 5 times 12 is 60. Next the first five multiples of 400. So if you're going up in your 400 times table the first multiple would be 400 then it would go up to 800, 1200, 1600 and then 2000. If, for example, it asked you for the tenth multiple of 400, well, we just do 400 times by 10, which is 4,000. So, moving on to the LCM. The LCM is also known as the lowest common multiple. The LCM is the smallest positive whole number that is a multiple of two or more numbers. So, to find the LCM, the first thing you do is list the first few multiples of each number and then you'd look for the first number that is the same in both lists. So if we do some examples on this, find the LCM of 3 and 4. So if we list the first few multiples of 3, the first multiple is 3, then we got 3 times 2 is 6, 3 times 3 is 9, 4 times 3 is 12, 5 times 3 is 15. Then if we do the multiples of 4, so 4 times 1 is 4, 4 times 2 is 8, 4 times 3 is 12. Well, I'm going to stop there because we can see that in both lists we have a number that is the same, which is 12. So, the LCM of 3 and 4 equals 12, as that's the first multiple that we come to that's the same in both lists. Next, we've got 8 and 10. So, again, if we list the multiples of 8, first multiple is 8, second is 16, 3 times 8 is 24, 4 times 8 is 32, 5 times 8 is 40, then if we go on to the 10s, 10, 20, 30, 40, and again I can stop at this point because I can see that I've got a number that's the same in both lists, and that is 40. You may have known that straight away without writing out the list. However, it's always really important to show your workings and your method as to how you've got 
the LCM, how you've got the answer to be 40. So we always need to write the times tables or the multiples, the list of the multiples out first. Next, the LCM of 24 and 9. So, 24 and then 9. This time I'm going to do the 9 times table first. So we got 9, then we got 18, 27. 9 times 4 is 36. Remember when you're doing your 9 times tables, you can use your fingers to help you. 9 times 5 is 45. So then if I write some for the 24s, well, 1 times 24 is 24. 2 times 24, well, double 24 is 48. So you need to keep going a little bit more in my 9 times tables. Don't panic if the LCM doesn't show straight away in the first few multiples you can keep going in the times tables or in the list of multiples for both until you come to a number that is the same so after 45 9 times 6 is 54 9 times 7 is 63 9 times 8 is 72 and then 24 times 3 well if you don't know that in your head you can always do a tower sum um using the chinese you can always do a short multiplication using the chinese method or the column method or you can do the continuous tower sum so 24 times 3 is 72 well we can see now we've got a number that is the same in both lists so the LCM of 24 and 9, the first number that we come to in both times tables is 72. So the LCM equals 72. If they asked you for the LCM of three numbers, well, we would just do a third list, but the number would have to be the same in all three lists.